folks, and welcome back to Indiana Jones and the Fate of Atlantis. We're gonna go to the good ending this time, so we're gonna rescue Sophia. So we're going to talk to Sophia. Sophia? Well? Yep. I just crawled through a mile of mud for you. It was a picnic compared to life in this cell. I bet it was. Did you miss me? Put it this way, even your company beats this cell. Are you alright? I'll feel a lot better once you open this cell. Yep. What I give? Hinch based is the bear. What am I supposed to do with this? Maybe we'll think of something. Yep. And I'll pick up the cage. Are you sure this is safe? I've got a plan. Which is? Brace the cage with a hinge pin. Brace the cage with a hinge pin. You know, that just might work. There! You know, I had to slug you. Come on, Sophia, don't be angry. Angry? You left me rotting in this hellhole! Well, if that's how you feel, maybe you should stay here. Well, maybe I will. Great idea. Fine. Fine. What was that? I'm not sure. I think Nur Absol made me do it. Is that so? Oh. Dangerous fella, that Mr. Sam. Yeah. Kissy kissy. Yeah. Well, we better be going. Now uh, we'll pick up cage. I need this pinch pin. Look over here. We'll lay. Indy, Nurab Sal is here. I sense his presence. Hold on a minute. Where exactly is he? Right around the corner. I'm sure of it. Show me. All right. Prepare yourself and follow me. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh, yeah. For crying out loud. We gotta go through this again. In here, Indy. Follow me. I'll follow ya. Ah, oh, Dr. Jones. 
Welcome to my humble abode. Nah, your humble of home sucks. <laughs> Is it to your home? Forget it. Now we'll pick up the pin, the scepter. And the bad version, we only needed one bead. The good ending, we're gonna need two beads. Excuse me. I hear you. Come on, Sophia. Let's get out of here. Never. I'm staying right here with the spirit who guides my thoughts. Hello, spirit guide. My name's Jones. Yes, I know you. You'll make a fine slave. Oh, yeah? Don't count on it. That's what I say. Why are you acting like this? Acting like what? Speak your mind, Carl! Let me talk to the mortal woman. Make it quick. The time for human frailty is past. How can I help you? I can't help myself, that's for sure. My willpower is gone, replaced by the thing I found and thought I owned. It's all up to you, Indy. What can I do? The one who feeds on fire is always hungry. Desperate moments require desperate measures. Okay. Look at Sophia's necklace. Mind if I look at your necklace? Then we'll put an orcalcum bead in the mouth. That medallion is hot! Drop it, why don't you? Nurab Sal won't let me! Nurab Sal won't let you. Oh. No! Sorry, Sophia. So long, Nurab Sal. Cindy, if you hadn't done that, I'd be as dead as that monster. I think we still got our old calcum bees, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> I think it's through them what we do. We're gonna bat if it did, we have to go and get more. Now let's go through here. You should have two rods now. Yep. Let's go through here. What did it say? Atlantean graffiti. Yep, this is up and in the middle. Okay, so maybe that last lever and the middle lever. Okay, I think, I think I might have it now. Going up? I'll wait down here. Suit yourself. No, and or cow 
can be to put in the stats of mouth the mouth here. And we'll use use rod with this the right slot. Push. Push. It's working. Get on board, Sophia. Get on board. Well, let's see here. Ah. That was close. Too close. Yeah, too close for comfort. Stick close, kid. This could be dangerous. I'll take my chances. Let's 
try this again. Coming? Hold your horses! Nice moves. Thanks. Here's your shining city. Not what I expected, that's for sure. And the place is still humming, maintaining the air pressure for untold centuries. Oh, no welcome to Atlantis, Indy. Oh, I guess that was after the sub. Welcome to Atlantis. That didn't do anything. Ah, oh, darn it. Still nothing. Now, cr crying out loud. I'm gonna have to reload this too, ain't I? Nothing again. What's well aligned mean, I wonder? What's reload mean? Random as all it is. I 
think it is. Not great. Coming? Hold your horses! Yeah, so fan makes it look easy because it's a computer. Nice moves. Thanks. Here's your shining city. Not what I expected, that's for sure. And the place is still humming, maintaining the air pressure for untold centuries. Yeah, let's go inside. Turned it on. You see, Colonel? I told you taunts would be of some use to us. Kerner, I knew I smelled a rat. All I smell, Herr Chons, is your fear. Don't move. My God, how beautiful! Congratulations, Dr. Jones! You've just handed the Sir Bright its ultimate victory! It'll take more than a few orichalcum bombs to conquer the world, Uberman. Bombs? The gods don't need bombs. Take a look around! What do you think this astonishing machinery was used for? That's a mystery. Religious ceremonies? Wrong! As Plato himself well knew, this was a factory for manufacturing higher beings! While you've been wandering around, we've been stockpiling orichalcum. And now we have all we need! Are you ready for the greatest moment in history, Doctor? Do you really believe in this godhood business? Why not? As a god, I shall know everything, be everywhere, rule everyone! We both shall rule here, Doctor. Eh? Don't be silly, Colonel. You're not prepared for this. We shall see. Okay. You're talking suicide, gentlemen. Scientific discoveries belong to the board, Chons. That's something you of all people should understand. Didn't you notice all those hideously deformed bones? Experiments gone awry, unworthy slaves sacrificed in the name of knowledge, 
Progress has its price, you know. Maybe they weren't quite human to begin with. Inhuman or subhuman, they were destroyed by their physical imperfections and they bathed in the awesome power of this device. Fortunately, we suffer from no such imperfections. Godhood sounds good. I like a crack at that. I like a man with courage. No! What? If anyone's going to become a god, it must be me. You don't make me laugh. I am in charge of this operation, you spineless sausage. Activate the machine. <sighs> a test is a test. Total suggested can be. Let's try that. Wait. What now, Charles? Fatal's diary says not to use any beads. Because bees won't buy you godhood. No. Oh, go ahead. You could use some self-improvement. You sound a little too happy about this. Tell me what's so amusing. I think Plato prescribed an aura calcum overdose. Hmm. Just a thought. You may be right. We should divide by ten. Try one bead. One bead it is! <laughs> Himmel! It's working! A small bead for a small man, eh, Charles? Now it's your turn! Uh, uh, no thanks. Godhood's for egomaniacs like you. Move! Unless you want my men to move you! That's better! What makes you think you can outdo the old kings? Science, my boy! We have it, and say so didn't! Here goes! Hang on a second! Okay, so... Please, Professor, don't make me do this. Please, Professor, don't make me do this. Look on the bright side! You'll be leaving your cares behind! <laughs> hey, right there's a line off the bat, you know, you'd make a much better god than me. You know, you'd make a much better god than me. That goes without saying, but there's no reason to turn up your nose at the chance to become one of the lesser immortals. Uh, I guess that wasn't it, I was probably just dreaming. Please, Professor, I've got classes to teach. Stop whining, man! Let's not take chances. How does 20 beads sound? No beads, you crazy old man. Come now, Doctor. Spare your scientific curiosity. Let's call the whole thing off. It's not too late. Let's call the whole thing off. Show some spine, man! How many beads should we use? No beads. Forget your stupid obsession. Really, Dr. Jones? Get a grip on yourself! We've still got a chance if we leave now. Glory belongs to the fearless, Jones! Listen, what if Plato's error went the other way? How do you mean? You can't buy Godhood for a couple of beads. 
All right, Chons, you decide. How many beads should we use? No beads. Let's get out of here. Not yet. Oh, there's our line. For your sake, I hope this doesn't work. For your sake, I hope this doesn't work. Why not? Once I'm a god, I'm sending you straight to hell. Once I'm a god, I'm sending you straight to hell. I'm offering you immortality. Is that the thanks I get? Ever hear the term angry god? Wait till you see me. Hang on! Perhaps I haven't thought this through. You want to go fast. You're scheming against me in spite of my generosity. Well, you won't get the upper hand that way. Stand aside, Jones. Ninety-eight? Ninety-nine? One hundred beats! Prepare to feel my wrath! Sophia. Follow me, I know the way. I'm not screwing up the shake every time. This is a nice effect though. Hurry! You know, a lot of my discoveries seem like tall tales even to me. At least there's some evidence this time. Then again, maybe not. Then again, maybe not. What was that for? To ease the pain. game to play even though it does have its moments oh I guess there's nothing left for me to say except enjoy the credits and thanks for watching bye
Thank <laughs> you. 